all that. These, I think, isn't that awful? Well, it's <laughs> for me. Oh my god. Good time tonight. <laughs> also for my stockings. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So we are now in Pennsylvania. We've been hanging out here for the last couple days and we did some Black Friday shopping and did some Thanksgiving celebrating, but I decided not to do a bunch of vlogging on this trip and just enjoy family time. But today my mom and I are actually headed out to do a little bit of Christmas shopping and just kind of do a little shop with me style video. Before we get going, I wanna let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Shop tagger and we're gonna tell you a little bit about it I was just telling my mom about it and I think it's like a very very useful tool because as influencers we often give you guys all the great deals but this is a way for you to sorry I keep cutting my mom <laughs> this is a way for you to find the deals on your own and to be able to keep track of them and whatnot I think it'll be a great tool for for Grammys to save money yeah yeah. So basically the way that it works is you can actually keep track of certain items that you're wanting to purchase and you are able to see when they go on sale and you can set it to like 25% off or 50% off and as soon as that sale happens it will alert you. So you can imagine as different things go on sale of how much money you could really save and not be constantly tracking down all of these sales which of course as influencers we like to let you know about them but I think this would be a great tool whenever you're looking for something super specific. So something that I've actually been keeping track of on ShopTagger is the new Keurig. And I've been really wanting one and of course multiple stores sell them. So I can look right on there and watch as different stores go on sale and which one has the best deal for me. All you have to do is hit the link in the description box. It will take you to the page to download the extension for your Chrome browser and you just hit add to Chrome and follow those steps. It's super simple and then I'm going to give you an example here of how I use this. So I've been hunting down some gifts for my sister-in-laws and one thing that's really great is I can actually make lists up with ShopTagger. So you'll see I can select the list that I want to add it to. Next, I can select whenever the price changes, whenever it goes 25% off or even 50% off. Any of those notifications, I can get pinged right to my phone if I have the app downloaded on it. You can also get push notifications through your email as well. I just feel like this is such a great way to stay so organized and on top of everything. It's an incredibly huge help whenever shopping. This is one of my lists that I have all of my sister-in-law's gift ideas on and things I'm keeping an eye on. Another feature that ShopTiger has is coupons. You can obviously browse them on their coupon page, but a way that they've made it even more simple is you can go straight to your website that you're shopping on, load up your cart with all of your goodies, and then whenever you go to your cart, you will see if there is coupons found, the Shop Tagger extension will let you know that. All you have to do is hit the button and it will actually insert all of the codes that it has available to see if they work. So you don't have to sit and try punching in coupon codes. It tries them all for you. And like you see here, I actually landed one that got me an extra 20% off. The last thing I wanted to tell you is that Shop Tiger is hosting a thousand dollar giveaway. It's super simple. The rules are you need to be signed up with Shop Tiger if you aren't already, which obviously is completely free. And then you need to tag two items in December. The entries are valid between December 1st and December 14th. The winner will be chosen December 15th and notified directly through email. I will leave all of the giveaway rules in the description box as well as the link to try out ShopTagger. So where do you want to go first? I think we'll go to Target first. Mm, of course. Target. That's just where we live. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe this Grammy can find some great stocking stuffers. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I do have a good bit of Christmas shopping to do, so I think getting Target out of the way first would be good, and then we can go get dinner and then mm -hmm. decide. Somewhere along the way, we have to get some coffee. Yeah, well, Target has that. See, that's actually the true bottom line of why we go to Target first. It is, it is. We can be <laughs> warm, we can go in and stand in line for our coffee. Yeah. We don't need to sit in our vehicle. <laughs> yeah. I am the easiest customer at Starbucks. I do not need a whole menu in my cup. I just need heavy cream. I got enough room 
I'm fine, thanks. <laughs> These are the best tumblers ever. I actually replaced the straw with a stainless steel straw because they're stainless steel and so you can use it to put like lemon essential oil in your water and it's obviously not plastic. Plus they keep stuff cold for a super long time. So if you're looking for an inexpensive tumbler, I highly recommend these. What? <laughs> oh my word, it has feet too. It even has feet. I think they love that. Yeah, I know. Queen of the ki of the kingdom. That's cute. Oh, there you go. <laughs> yes, this is the one I need right now in my <laughs> life. This one right here. of this one with this. But what do you think, Mom? Do you think this would survive outside? No, I think so, if it's not raining on it. Yeah, if it's a, if you have a relatively, I just love the idea of stacking rugs. Actually, hang on, just to bring in another earthy tone, we design. We design, or we restock their shelves. <laughs> Alphabetize things. Is it pretty solid stuck together, or would if you like, kicked it, into yeah. it? Well, if it wasn't, if it was on top of like a patio. That's even thicker yet. I love the fact that this isn't like the regular natural bristle rug. It's oh black. yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like way over there. <laughs> get in frame, mom. We didn't get that much in Target other than we drank coffee and looked at rugs. And decided and what she was getting in her stocking. Oh yes, okay, so QVC <laughs> is having this huge sale and I want a couple of them, so this is something I'll probably be using Shop Tiger for. But they have fiddly fig trees that are really nice and they go on sale at certain times. And right now they're on sale. And so we were standing in Target and I was t we were discussing this because they had other ones at Target but they cost mm -hmm. more. And so then I was like, oh, they're on sale right now. So mm -hmm. mom's like, well, that can be your stocking stuff. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, stuff a tree in my stocking. So we put back the other thing she thought yeah. she wanted that yeah. would have fit into her stocking. Yeah. So by the way, this is her stocking stuffer and her Christmas gift. Yeah, for the fiddly fig tree. So anyways, but I did grab this, which I think is really cute. I'm going to put this on in my pantry door um, whenever I, like, take all of my Christmas stuff down. I'm already starting to think about, like, what I want to do with the house after Christmas because I'm always trying to be one step ahead. You, when do you take your Christmas stuff down? I first of all have to put it up. Yeah, you haven't decorated. <laughs> Sorry. Your life is too crazy. Oh my well, there's arm. some of us who kind of stick with the season. Yeah. But remember, I do like to redecorate my tree. Yeah. She, I, that's right. She I does. I do. She, did you ever, didn't you do it for like Valentine's Day one time? Yeah. 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 I, there's been times I've done it three times in the season. Yeah. It's little enough I can do that. Yeah. She's got a little tree. Yeah. So, I do have a little tree and I'd like to get a bigger one. I used to have a bigger one though. This is yeah. my yeah yeah so anyways i don't know like i kind of try to do a lot of my christmas stuff which you guys know this if you watch my videos often but my christmas stuff is pretty neutral it's more like winter looking yeah and like i actually don't even know that i'm going to decorate my tree this year because it's flocked and it just looks so pretty like even without anything on it whenever they're flocked and mm -hmm. lit mm -hmm. and everything so i may mm -hmm. just leave it completely bare plus i'm really afraid that my three daughters will just take all of the bulbs off my tree Mom. she lets them <laughs> she lets them just like totally take everything off of her tree and then they put it back on but you see then when they're not around then i just take them off and i put it the way i like it so yeah. but you can't do that whenever they live with yeah you. and it would just That's... be a constant like redecorating that's, of the tree. By the way, that's a Grammy treat, and that's something that's really a cool thing for Grammys to do. Let them decorate part of the tree. Yeah. yeah. Get They have a lot mm -hmm. of really cute unbreakable bulbs. Oh, yeah. yeah. And, and you know what? Somehow, one of my bulbs was, was glass, and yeah. they broke it the other day, and it was just like totally an accident. And they felt, they felt so bad. They did, and today when they were decorating the tree, they took they, they've redecorated since we've been here the last couple days they've decorated it like three times and so today they actually were looking in the box of bulbs and they would get 
them out and they would bounce them across the floor to see if oh oh my goodness <laughs> of course oh my so word so i started to show them how you can decide if it's glass or if it's plastic well we're gonna go in and we're gonna grab some food <laughs> My nephew likes to sweep, and this would be a great. Won't knock my house down. <laughs> yeah. It's actually one that I can use too. Yeah, if you really needed it for something. Oh, I need this. Jay, it's coming. <laughs> Are those those drying rack things? I just love to lay, like you unroll them and lay them across your sink. So I'm thinking about getting this pedestal for the center of my table. Once I'm done with what I already have on there for Christmas, I think it'd be really cute with green plants on it for the spring. What would you put in there, Addie? I don't know what I would stick in there. What would you put in it? I don't know, but I would certainly. Everyone, like, everybody would look in it. My special I know, ingredient. And they would always wonder when they walk in the house. What's in there? What's in there? You could make it different every time. I could, or it could just be empty. Yeah. And I could say that it's just so full of love. It's love. It's love. There you go. Mm -hmm. This cinnamon smells good, and I like the outside. Look at that, that's pretty. It looks nice on the outside, but I don't like the inside. <laughs> I don't like how it smells. Oh, this one smells really good, though. Smell this one. Oh, yeah, what is it? I don't know, it cheer. just says cheer. <laughs> It's a redone. It's a redone. It's apple cider. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's what it smells like. Yeah. Mm, yum. Oh, that's. These, I think. <laughs> Isn't that awful? Well, it's who makes? I don't understand why people. They tried make... to make pine. You can tell. Whoa! I'm like. Oh my god. <laughs> it looks like headlights. I'm not even kidding. Look, you can see my shadow yeah, back yeah. there. <laughs> We're doing hand puppets. Good time tonight. <laughs> Word, Mom. <laughs> look at look at our shadows. Look at the shadows. <laughs> We're trying to find lighting. It's not that bad, actually. It's actually okay. What you say? <laughs> she has her light on her phone. <laughs> if you're wondering why we're laughing, so I'm gonna show you a little um, TJ Maxx haul right now. Just got a couple things, but they're like good things. What else? did you get? Anything besides wrapping paper for yourself? <laughs> I didn't even get wrapping paper. <laughs> oh, I thought that's what you had. Oh no, you got the broom. She got the broom for it. So I got this, or mom got this for me, also for my stockings. <laughs> you guys wanna know how big my stocking is? <laughs> I got this big pedestal. I think I showed it before. It's really, really heavy. I don't know, what kind of wood do you think it's made of? I really don't know. I seriously don't know. Mm -hmm. And then I just got a to-do list. So mm -hmm. we are gonna go over to Michael's and see what they have going on over there. Okay, we're back at my mom's house and I thought I would just show you because she has one over her sink. But these are the things that we found at TJ Maxx that she's going to put in my sister-in-law's stockings. I just don't think I would use it enough. But like I said, Amazon carries them too. You could probably just search over sink dish strainer or something like that. Oh, here she's got one of the things. But I think they're kind of handy because you can roll them up and put them away versus having a really big dish strainer over your sink. I went shopping earlier today at like a local store with my mother-in-law. And I thought I would show you guys just because the stuff I found was so cute. Um, I got this little towel and it says, Silence is golden unless you have children. Then silence is suspicious, which I thought would be cute. Um, like after I put away all of my Christmas stuff to hang on my oven. And then I found these. I think they're just so cute. They're these little mugs. 
perfect for the girls and they're all about having either like decaf coffee or hot chocolate this one says you mocha me happy this one says cool beans on it and then this one says you're one awesome brew which i just think that they're gonna have so much fun with these you're gonna help me end the video did we have fun today yeah, we had a really good time. We did. We went to eat at Mo's. Mo's. Yeah, and that had was the salad. second time that I had went. Yeah, it was, it was really good. It was good. It was, it was really, really good. good. And we bumped into a good friend of mine. Mm -hmm. And that made the evening fun too. Yeah, so it did. Anyway, um, we got some really good deals. Yeah, we did. Thanks for shopping with me. Yeah, I'm really glad that you're here. Yeah, I miss we'll you. We'll come more. back. I know. <laughs> I know. Everybody always asks, like, doesn't your mom miss you so much? It's like, yeah, well, what, you know, what, what are you, you yeah, what are you going to do about what it? What am I going to do about it? And am I supposed to bawl about it and stomp my feet and cry every time I see her? No, or she'd never call me back. <laughs> oh, we need the question of the day. Do you like to go skiing? <laughs> <laughs> That's random. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> Mike likes to ski. He always wanted me to go skiing with him. And I don't know if he wanted to hurt me, just throw me down the steps. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, she used to always tell me, don't bother taking me skiing with you. Just throw me down the steps. It'll get the same effect. Oh, my <laughs> word. Okay, do you like to ski? If you like to ski, let us know in the comments. I hate skiing. I've gotten hurt so many times That's right. skiing. I never went skiing because I knew I would get hurt. That's yeah. why I said, just throw me down the steps. <laughs> <laughs> So horrible. <laughs> Anyways, if you're new to my channel and like this kind of content, <laughs> hit the subscribe button. <laughs> Thanks guys for watching. Don't forget to give this video a like and I'll see you in my next video.